Hello, I'm Tamika Fletcher, one of the co-owners of Natural Resources Salon and one of the founders of Earth's Nectar Products. One of my favorite styles to create on natural hair, especially curly natural hair, is a braid out. A braid out is simple to create, really easy to do, and I'd like to give you a few tips on how to create a perfect braid out. People come into the salon pretty often, and one of their simple requests is a twist out or a braid out. But one of the things they tell me really often is that, for whatever reason, their braid outs or their twist outs don't quite come out the way they expected. And so I'd like to give you a few tips to show you how to get a perfect braid out every single time. And so, to get started, we use a leave-in detangler. Again, the product that you use to get this started if your hair is not already wet is a leave-in detangler. A leave-in detangler can be made by using nine parts water and one part conditioner, or you can buy a pre-made detangling spray. I like to use Nourish by Earth's Nectar. Nourish is great because it doesn't build up. It's a great way to get the process started before you even begin detangling. Once you've done that, you want to kind of decide what size curls you want. If you want big curls, you'll use larger braids. If you want small curls, then you'll use smaller braids. You'll also decide what type of set you want. For this, I'd like to give her a soft set. I want her to have definition, but I definitely don't want the hair to feel firm and crunchy when finished. And so we'll use a product called Coconut Curls. This product is also by Earth's Nectar. But the great thing about this product is that it does give your hair definition, but there's a little secret on how to use the product to bring out the curl in your hair, no matter what the texture. So the first thing we'll do is to divide the hair into the section that we've decided to twist, and we'll use medium-sized sections for her twist out. The next step is to take the coconut curls, rub it in the hair from root to tip. The goal here is to show the definition of the curl. Once the hair is completely detangled, use a rubber brush, starting at the tip of the hair, working your way down to the root. We're doing this because we want to really show the de definition in the curl. Coconut Curls is a wonderful product to hold, to detangle, to moisturize, to add shine, but most of all, we want it to set the hair and hold the twist out in place for several days. And so to do that, you really want to make sure that you're going all the way to the tip so that you can see all of the curl in the hair. The next tip I'll give you is to make sure that your ends have been properly trimmed. There's nothing worse than a twist style or any afro style with really bad ends. And so you want to make sure that maybe every three months you've made sure that you've dusted off the ends of your hair. This is something that you could do at home or you can go into the salon to do. But the key here is to make sure that the finished look is finished with great trimmed ends. The next step is to braid the hair. Remember, braiding the hair with small curls or small braids will give you a small curl. Today we'll use a medium size braid, twist about one inch from the end of the hair, and I end with a two strand twist. Now remember, smooth out the ends to make sure that whatever you twist you'll untwist. And so if the hair feels lumpy in your fingers or feels like it's not very smooth, be sure and smooth it out. We're ending with a two strand twist because when it's time to remove this, you want to make sure to have an easy time unwinding it. This will guarantee that you can take it apart with ease and not to disturb the pattern in the curl. So remember a few tips. Divide the hair into sections, decide what size curl you want, comb through Detangled hair with a Denman brush or a rubber brush with product. Coconut curls is a great product to use if you've decided to do a twist out on dry hair especially. Trim the ends if they need it. Make sure that the hair is completely dry. If the twist is not, or the braid is not completely dry when, re when removing it, you'll end up with more of a fluffy style without a lot of definition. It may look like it's defined when you take it down, but about an hour later, it opens up and it starts to swell, and it doesn't really look like you spent the time that you spent twisting and adding product. The very last step is to finish with a gloss. Earth's Nectar makes a wonderful product called Hair Gloss. Hair Gloss is a finishing product that gives your hair brilliant shine without building up or over drying. Once that's done, style with your fingers. If you need to, you can use an afro pick to stick inside to lift out the parts, only if needed. 
pull your hair, something like this, to fluff it and separate it, and that's really it. Remember those few tips, and you'll get a perfect braid out every time. Thank you.